Hi there, I'm Dr. Stuart McBratney. I'm a lecturer in transmedia storytelling at the School of Creative Industries within the University of Newcastle, Australia. Currently, I'm researching transnational micro-budget cinema production. My team and I recently completed production of a feature film which was filmed in nine countries using high-end cameras on a budget that would have purchased approximately one second of Avengers Endgame. But before we get into this research, it's useful to look at my recent PhD thesis and its associated creative work. From 2014 to 2017, I undertook my PhD research here in Newcastle, and my thesis title was Pragmatism and Bricolage in Microbudget Feature Filmmaking. In this research, I argued that the filmmakers who have enjoyed the most favorable outcomes in creating ultra-low budget feature films are those who successfully balanced pragmatism and bricolage. Pragmatism in filmmaking is a practical approach to problem solving as opposed to an idealistic one, thereby restraining the scope of a production. Bricolage is the use of cinematic elements at your disposal, thereby increasing production values. The micro-budget filmmaker oscillates between these two approaches, seeking a lucid synthesis of compromise and artistry. To investigate the lived experience of the micro-budget feature filmmaker, I wrote, financed, produced, directed, acted in, edited, scored, and mixed such a film myself. The resulting work, Pop-Up, is the embodiment of my tacit knowledge of pragmatism and bricolage, and my thesis presented my explicit knowledge of the filmmaking experience. The completed film was selected for 22 international festivals. After it won a jury prize at the prestigious Dances with Films Festival in Los Angeles, I subsequently secured representation in Los Angeles as a director by a highly respected talent agency and equally regarded legal firm. This success enabled me to move on to another feature project as writer-director, titled Don't Read This on a Plane. I applied the same principles of pragmatism and bricolage, albeit on a larger scale. My new research looks at the methodology my team and I employed to make Don't Read This on a Plane. Filmed in Hungary, Greece, Romania, the Netherlands, France, Germany, Italy, Portugal, and Australia, it was shot predominantly on a red epic camera in 8K, the same system used to film the Hollywood blockbuster Guardians of the Galaxy 2. Don't Read This on a Plane is about a novelist who resorts to hitchhiking and sleeping rough during her European book tour after her publisher goes bankrupt. In keeping with the findings of my PhD research, I knew that designing a micro-budget production involves writing a screenplay around the means available. With this transnational concept in mind, I began contacting Europe's most famous and beautiful bookstores, including Atlantis Books in Santorini, Livraria Lello in Porto, Aqua Alta in Venice, and Bookhandel in Dominicanen in Maastricht. Encouraged by their eagerness to have their stores captured on screen, I completed the screenplay based around the bookstores which had agreed to a shoot. Had they been disinterested, I would have abandoned this project in favor of something else, but since they showed great enthusiasm, the itinerary was constructed around the means I now had at my disposal. In this case, some of the world's most beautiful bookstores. By using pragmatism and bricolage, my crew and I were able to design a transnational production of unprecedented scope. And while films with budgets 5,000 times greater may sacrifice the humanity of their characters in exchange for visual effects, we use technological advances to create a film about the human experience, a tale of identity, values, and the pursuit of dreams. Yet, unlike many films made for micro-budgets, Don't Read This on a Plane was not limited to one room, one building, one town, or even one country. New technology, on a project designed around available means, allows transnational cinema to be humanized in an affordable way. For those wishing to view Don't Read This on a Plane, a secret preview will screen at Filmfest Bremen, Germany on October 22nd. Otherwise, feel free to contact me to request a screener. Thank you for watching and enjoy the conference. Ne vous arrêtez pas, s'il vous plaît.